Welcome back, everyone, and welcome to Catacomb Kids. Uh, Catacomb Kids, the developers hooked me up with a key, and I was excited to show it to you. It's a roguelike 2D side-scroller uh, beat-em-up kind of game that focuses on experimentation, and it is kind of brutal. <laughs> it's kind of, think about it in the line of, say, Cave Story or Spelunky, that kind of game. Um, but it's very, it's it's a difficult game so far, um, so we're going to just go ahead and kind of dig in here. Um, we have, when you start, I mean, it's in very early alpha, it just released recently, so you have... Um, these different, so far so far, you only have two different classes. You've got the bully, which is more a melee class, and the poet, which is a more uh, uh, magic using type class. And and so we're gonna start with the bully just because it's more straightforward. Um, I will warn you ahead of time that I am quite bad at this game. <laughs> I have so far uh, managed to get the keys underneath me so that I don't completely spaz around, but um, but I am not actually what you would probably call good at this game so far. So my headphones are, for whatever reason, are not working very well today. Uh, but we'll just go with it. I can't hear much, but I don't think sound is super important to this game. Um, so we're gonna take, I guess, let's take this guy, because he's got a nice uh, health um, <laughs> amount there. He's got, alright, so we'll just head on in with this guy, see what we get. Um, so as you can see, it's this very much a, a top-down, or not top-down, a side-on um, game. Let's see, you've got the attack, you've got the jump. Down here, what is this? This is a this is a book. So we can hold it and use it, and that will show us what we got, which is a spell book. Um, and you use your little, the purple energy, the one that I have that's three out of three on the bottom, to learn these different things. And let's see, so we got, we have a flame wave, we've got an infernus, we've got a frost bolt, which can freeze things, launch an icicle to freeze enemies, and we've got a cold burst cone. So we only have three energy, so we can only do this frost bolt or the flame wave. Flame wave sounds ex more exciting, right guys? So let's take that. Alright, so let's see. So, um, it's a big on... In the classic roguelike fashion, it's big on experimentation in the sense that, uh, you know, I've got this potion, but I don't know what it is. So let's drink it and find out, shall we? Strength, awesome. So let's, uh... I see you. And you may have noticed that I, uh, I was able to... Oh man, that strength potion is really good. Potion of Might, another one. Okay. We pick up the corpse. Wanna eat this guy? Let's eat him, right? Yeah. Home. Things happen after you eat things sometimes. We got another potion of might. Can we drink it? Let's drink it. Alright, so let's see. Got some sort of little monster coming around this way. Yeah, there we go. So let's jump up here. This is a... Uh... Oh no! No, no, no! Get out of the burning! We're probably going to die now. Yeah, don't don't die, please. What is that? Oh, it's a teleport. Yeah, we died. Okay. Yeah, see? It's kind of a brutal, unforgiving game, especially early on when you don't have a lot of health. But uh, let's jump right back in, shall we? A new game. Bully. I'll, I'll show you the spellcaster ones in a, in a little bit, but let's try this guy. He's good with daggers, he hates spears, he's kind of clumsy and a messy eater. I don't really know what most of these things mean. Actually, this guy, he's defensive and good with swords, has five health. We're gonna, ch we're gonna pick you, buddy. Maybe we'll survive longer this time. Alright, so let's see if we can... You can, you can drop on things' heads to, d to kill them in some cases. Magic 101. Let's read this book and see what we got. Alright. We got Wizard Throw. Discovered accidentally when attempting to summon a purple tortoise. Summon an ethereal hand to grab and throw your enemies. I'm probably going to be on the. That's magic. Basically, magic blast. Whirlwind. Regenerate. So we only have enough um, 
energy for wizard throw anyway, so we're going to take that one. And we will get out of here. What is this guy? This is a ball of goo. So balls of goo are, allow you to do things like, like this, and then you can use the ball of goo as like a a, um, a uh, booster. <clears throat> Some of the keys... Oh, activated a trap there. So that was what that was. And it's going to take me up. Let's go up right here. We'll get off of this. Oh! I must have gotten stuck between it and the wall. Oh well. Try again. Yeah, yeah. New game. Bully. Why are you going to do that same... Oh, they're different people every time. I didn't notice that before. It's like randomized. Aha! Uh -huh. Let's take this guy. Four energy... I mean, three energy, four health, magic armor, magic weapon, poised, and a lord. He's not very fast. Oh, not lord. L loud. He's loud. Let's take this guy. Alright. So I'm going to guess that this is a... Come here, mister. Yeah, there we go. It's a magic weapon of some kind. Got him. Alright, so let's eat the bat, huh? Mmm, young bat. Tasty bat. Another bat. Oh, more bats. So, for reasons I don't yet understand, if you look down on the right hand or the left hand corner, you'll see that I am um, stacking up number of bats. I don't really know what that exactly means. I'm encased in the ice. Apparently, I have found an ice potion. I wonder how long that lasts. Come on. Wake back up. There we go. Alright. Looks like I lost... Whoops. I lost a little bit of health for that. That's okay. Let's pick this up. Can I hit this guy from here? I don't think I can. Oh! Man. That thing hit me hard. So yeah, so I'm not so good with the keys so far yet, in case you were, you probably picked up on that. So let's take one of these magic users this time. So let's see. Five out of five, five energy, hate swords, resourceful, bad swimmer, defensive. Magic armor, likes hammers, breath holder, and resourceful. Hmm. What do we want to pick here? Let's go with this person. Dawn Davies. See what we can do with her. So she has what as a power? Let's see, what does she have? What is this? Whirlwind, okay. And she has a spear? Alright. And so, you can also do things, I guess you can't with this, but you can do things like knock over those, um, those things. Oh, and we found our first level in cube. So the two goals of any dungeon, when you go into a dungeon, is to find the leveling orb and to find the exit and so this is the leveling orb so we're gonna do this and we'll level up and when you level up you get two points to spend um, so if you let's see so they rank them I guess this is like max spell charges max energy damage reduction speed I'm going to go with speed this time, even though it's kind of way down on the list. So we'll do speed, plus one speed, that's good. And then you get, uh, you can get, you can either upgrade another point, or you can do these little, uh, sprint up walls, auto evade attacks, and traps while sprinting. We'll do that. You can do these little active abilities, which is pretty cool. So this is the, sp oh yeah, okay, I see. Yeah, so, so when we're sprinting, we'll just go right up the wall. That's helpful. Oh, no, no, no. Let's not go in there. A... Bad things happen in there. Oh, no. You gotta watch out for that kind of stuff. So now we're in a bad s situation. Can we get out of here anyway? I think there's a... What? There's... 
there are bad things swimming around down there. We are not a good swimmer either. So I am concerned about this. Looks like we're going to have to deal with water no matter which way we go. So we are going to go... Let's see if we can slide down this. Uh, oh, no, no! How do we even get out of here? We can't. We can't get out of here like this. Okay. Alright. We're going to have to go through that other watery area, which is probably going to kill us. Since we are a bad swimmer. Yeah, there's no way out of here. How do I get out of here? There's got to be a way out of here. Hmm. I mean, it's possible that there isn't a way out of here. Well, we're dead anyways. I think the levels are procedurally generated, and this is very early alpha, so it's possible that there is no... that sometimes uh, mistakes happen, and we don't get... Let's do a magic user one more time. And there might not be pla might be places where you get stuck. I don't know that for a fact. I could have just been being a dumbass and there was a perfectly easy way to get out of there. Let's try Joseph Witz in here. See what kind of weapons and spells he has. What have you got? Slow? Alright, he's got slow. No spell book. Alright, so you have... what do you have weapons wise? An axe. Oh, some sort of small mushroom coming here. Let's eat it and find out what it does. Poison! Of course. So why wouldn't you eat a poison mushroom? I eat poison mushrooms all the time. I'm just gonna stand here and make sure we don't die. Because there's no reason to keep going if we're gonna just gonna end up dead. Alright. Last of the poison racks your body. Okay, good. Done with the poison. What happens? <laughs> it. <laughs> Apparently I didn't manage to hit him with my slow attack. So, yes, as you can see, a bit of a brutal game. I am feel like I'm getting... I do feel like... I'm going to go back to being a bully. I do feel like I'm st starting to get slightly better. I'm gonna take this guy. Brandy something. At least in the beginning, I didn't really. I the keys felt really off, out of whack for me, and I was having a lot of trouble with the keys. But I'm not having that problem so much anymore. She must have some sort of an ability, because she seems to be able to sense them. These bad guys around. Come down here, buddy. Zapped! I wonder what that meant. Got him. Nope. No. That zapped meant I got him. They did not. Oh, good. Alright, ball of goo. Alright, so let's keep moving. Some sort of potion over here. Come at me again, buddy. Nope, you're just gonna keep going. Oh, I almost got hit by that. So there's a... Let's take this potion and see what happens. Darkness envelops you. Potion of invisibility, okay. And this is kinda neat. I like this graphic. You might not be able to see it because I'm invisible. I like that they shake it. Dig it. And I got a decorated crown. What is that? Decorated crown. This crown is average. It has fancy details all over it. Okay. I like fancy details. Let's 
Smash it. Ah, yeah. So that's some of the details there where the like the bottle just smashed because the. Oh man. Keep getting stuck between the walls. Oh well. All right. Let's go one more, right? See, the game is brutal, but it's just it's just fun though. Like <laughs> I I die a lot, but it doesn't really bother me. Let's try this guy out, Randy Willis. I guess once you take once you somebody dies, they get removed from the list or something. I don't know. All right, so we got some money. There's just some money in there. Okay. I don't I haven't seen what the money is for yet. Purple potion. Drink that bad boy. Strength. That's what I like to see. Drown, you stupid rat. Yeah, get it. Ball of goo. Everyone loves a ball of goo. Hey, I got a bottle of water now. That's kind of cool. See, that's the, uh... That's the experimentation I was talking about. That, you know, you pick up... I don't know why he's shaking like that, to be honest. Um, wait. Can I see what he's doing? What's wrong with him? Zapped, whatever that means. And there's this taunt thing that I don't really understand yet, so, like... We have to wait for him to stop being zapped. I don't know, still don't know what that means. You lose your charge. What does that mean? Oh, you know what I think it is? Is since he's like he's got like electrical powers, he doesn't like. Um, I see you. No. He doesn't like being. Oh man, really? One hit? He doesn't like being wet. Is what I think was going on there. All right, one more, one more, one more. See. <laughs> See, this game is brutal, but we're going to do a, a poet one more time. But I like it. It's making me happy. Ben Herring it is. This game also has controller support, by the way. What is my spell here? Poison Blob. Can I see that better? Once just a foul smelling practical joke, this toxic spell has been made deadly over the years. Okay, launches a bouncing ball of poison. Okay. That seems like that would be useful. It has controller support. I don't know, I, I was started to mention that and then stopped. Um, so if you, oh, oh, hang on. Got him. So if you're a controller kind of guy, you like that kind of stuff. Let's take this crimson potion and see what we got. Health potion, that's what, awesome. I love health potions. Um, you can do that. I'm not a controller person, so, I mean, I, I have done it in the past, but. Die, yeah. There's a lot of bad guys down here. I probably shouldn't fight that guy down there though, because I only have one health. He does have a health potion. He has some kind of potion. Can I? I'm gonna wait for this guy to come back. And I'm gonna jump on his head. There we go. So let's see if we can try this. Um. Man, I probably shouldn't. I was gonna... I was gonna use my ball of goo on him. Did that work? This might get it stuck. Nope. Oh, it bounces back up. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and try and fight that guy. It's probably gonna end my death, mean in my death, but, uh, I don't... I'm worried about trying to get past those spikes over there. And there's also, um... Can I not do a roll? Some way to do a, a roll, but I can't. So we're gonna wait for this guy to come back to the door, so that we can hit him with the door when we go through it. Come here, buddy. Get over here. Hey, 
Hey, we got him. Purple potion, that's different. Let's try this. Actually, let me drop this first. A desk. I've not seen a desk before, so I'm gonna have to try that first. Polished plate mail. Uh, sure. Oh, good. Let's look at this desk. I've not seen a desk. Find the spell book. Temporal tricks in the drawer. Oh, cool. I need the spell book. I will drink you in a minute, potion. Let's see what this does. Temporal tricks. Spell directly alters the temporal continuity begins. That's the slow spell. Haste. Grouped up. That makes you faster. Briefly extends the user's existence through a stretch of time, violently disrupting anything caught in the wake. Move more quickly, leaving a damaging trail behind. I kinda like the sound of that one. Undo. Let's take let's take this one. We're gonna learn a temporal step. How's this this spear is he doesn't is he against spears? What's his traits? I don't remember how to look at his straight. Oh, they're up there. No? Well, I don't know where his traits are. Shh. Hey! Sorry, Daphne's making noise. Let's drink this potion though and find out what it does. Darkness. Okay. Here we go. Nice to be invisible. Oh, oh, I almost made that. Come on, get up there. Come on, get up there, you little guy. There you go. Alright, so that's gonna be us. There we go. Something down there, but I'm not gonna go down there and look at it right now. Gotta find the leveling book, or the leveling orb thing. Come on, one more. Oh, got him. Ball of goo. Oh, there's the leveling orb. There we go. Come here, you. Got it. Alright, so let's level up. Yeah, that's what we like to see. Let's do damage, or defensive, rather. That's the what I wanted. Extra tough. I am extra tough. Amazing. Let's take this ball of slime, see what it does. Oh, water. Yeah, I don't need you right now. There we go, come on, there we go. Runic Venomous Cough. Plus magic. Alright, I'll take that. Oh, look, he's got a little hat. Very cute. Take me back up, please, machine. Thank you. Take this ball of goo with us. wonder what happens if I eat a ball of goo. I haven't eaten any balls of goo. I like the... My, my philosophy is... I wonder what happens if I eat it. Which is almost exactly my exact opposite philosophy to what happens in my real life. Because <laughs> I'm a very, very picky eater. But, uh, it's kind of funny. Get him. Get him. Got it. Alright, let's, uh... Oh, he's a he's pissed now. Look at him. Yeah. Stay dead. What is this? Alright, let's take this verdant potion. That's a good word. Verdant. Poison. Alright, we're probably gonna die. I don't think we have enough. Oh, knocked it over. That's what I meant how you can knock those things over. Gotta wait for that fire to go out now. There we go. I find it hard to believe we're not going to die from this. We don't have a lot of health. 
E, there we go. Alright, so that's the exit right there. Let's see if we can get up there. No, get out of the water. Piranha's in the water. There we go. Let's just leave. I know there's another potion there, but I, I want out. Want out. Alright, so let's see. Ooh, a switch. Uh huh. Okay. Just raised a little shelf down there. Come here, you. Man, these things. This thing takes a beating. Yeah, screw him. He can stay there for all he wants. I don't need him. Where are you going, Mr. Bat? I don't really like spears, I've come to decide. Oh no! Aw oh, man! Alright. Well, that's Catacomb Kids. Uh, I think it's pretty neat. Uh, I'll definitely be keeping an eye on this. I had thought about doing a series on this when I originally loaded it up, but I don't think I'm good enough at it yet to get away with it. So uh, I'll keep practicing, and probably a few alpha updates down the road I might actually do a series on this game. But I thought it was pretty cool, and I wanted you guys to see it. So I hope hope you enjoyed watching it. Uh, if you did, please leave me a like. helps me out a great deal. Uh, consider subscribing if you haven't done that already, and I will see you guys later. Thanks so much.